Hello, hello, welcome. I'm Eddie Hirschlag in Natural Health, and today we're going to talk about the heart sound recorder. Um, to me, it's just, well, it's just going to be me today. Um, it's not going to be Dr. Mark. Uh, Dr. Chip will show up a little bit later in this presentation, but I just wanted to kind of give you a brief un understanding of what the heart sound recorder is, but we'll still kind of play a role as it pertains to how we look at things at Natural Health. So the heart sound recorder is a low-risk general wellness device designed to assess the heart status by generating the graphs. Um, of the heart sound. So I'll show you a live presentation during this, but what we're going to be doing is kind of diving into how the stressors come into a lot of the play with this. So the way we look at, na at natural health is three different ways. We look at the nutritional toxins, we look at the physical traumas, and the emotional thoughts. So when we talk about stresses, um, we're talking when it comes to the heart sound recorder as it pertains to the nutritional efficiencies of the heart. So let's kind of put these in mind when we talk about um, the different stressors that we have in the particular parts of the heart. So like we talked about last week, the health of the heart is a mere image of the health of the body. So we'll look at these four different valves here, and you can see this is kind of a down view angle. Right here is the left side of the heart. But these are the valves that we're actually going to be um, recording today. There's different parts in the body that we place the microphone, but when it comes to the actual vibrations that we get from here, uh, we'll be picking up these different valves and the strength and the vitality in these different valves can reflect uh, the strength of the vitality of the actual body. So the first thing that I see when I do a lot of these heart sound recorders is the vitamin B complex. When we look at the vitamin B complex, we're looking at these all different parts of the actual vitamin B complex. It's not just one part of the vitamin B. All these kind of need to put in place to get a strong um, stance of the heart. And we kind of come down and see here is it is a water soluble vitamin. The way that I look at that is it needs to be constantly going back into circulation in the body if you constantly have stress going on. And the big one that I look at here is vitamin B12. When we look at vitamin B12, there's a lot of different deficiencies as it comes to vitamin B12 because vitamin B12, you can only get it from meat or um, animal arranged origin products. So when we kind of look at the vitamin B deficiencies, and just help me out, if you see on your day-to-day -day basis um, with yourself or any people around um, that you're surrounded with that might have any mental problems. I mean, just maybe some um, brain fog, um, fatigue is another big one of vitamin B deficiency. So we want to make sure that we can get plenty of those vitamin Bs in our body because these are water soluble. So we need to constantly keep these rolling in there it's because the stressors that we have on our bodies when it comes to the nutritional part, the physical part, as well as the emotional part, all those different types of stressors can deplete these different ones, these different vitamin B stores. So we can look at hair problems, we can look at chronic pain, infertility, and blood disorders. So kind of keep in mind that when we're looking at the, the vitamin B complex, we got to make sure we kind of get all of these, especially that vitamin B12. The next one that we're going to look at, and I always look at this coming popping up on this heart sound recorder, is the vitamin C complex. The vitamin C complex is not ascorbic acid. The vitamin C complex is the whole entire complex. The vitamin C, the ascorbic acid, is just the outline of it. So when you look at kind of a supplement bottle, you see in the back of it, got to make sure it doesn't just say ascorbic acid. We want the whole vitamin C complex as it pertains to all of these vitamins. We want the whole complex because how I was taught is once it goes into the body as a synthetic vitamin, it'll start robbing different parts of the body to making sure we complete that vitamin C complex or vitamin B complex to be utilized in the body. So we want to make sure we get to that because it's very crucial for the adrenal gland. The adrenal gland goes directly with these stressors in the body. If you constantly have stressors from a, from a nutritional, from a physical and an emotional aspect of life, your organ, your adrenal glands will just start getting overwhelmed and they'll start getting more fatigued over time. So we got to make sure, in the same point, keeping those vitamin B, vitamin C complex um, vitamins in constant circulation because it is a water soluble vitamin. We need to keep it rolling in there. It's not a fat soluble vitamin. When we have a fat soluble vitamin, it usually stays in our circulation much longer in our own little fat tissues in our body. The last big one that I looked at from the heart sound recorder is the heart protomorphogen. The protomorphogen, we're looking on a cellular level. And how we look at the protomorphogen and the teachings behind this is an autonomic response. 
And the best analogy that I do for um, when I was working for Standard Process, Standard Process provides this protomorphogen, and I believe it's one of the crowning achievements of the Standard Process products. But it kind of acts like as a shield. So the body is kind of essentially attacking itself, and in this situation we'll say the heart. The body is going and it's attacking the actual cell over and over and over again. Once the protomorphogen comes into play, it acts as a shield to making sure that heart stays safe. So it can concrete a lot, much stronger heart. But we can always kind of look at that, well, why is the body attacking itself? And we can look at many different ways of how the different stressors that we have in the body when it comes to nutritional, the physical, and the emotional aspects of life. So, but as in the main point, when here, we can look at the different areas of these different products that we look at, always focus on these different uh, parts of the heart. We want to make sure we have a very good heart rate I mean, when we look at this um, heart sound recorder, we'll see if it is it pulsing too fast, is it going too slow, or you're very anxious and anxiety like doing a presentation, or you're kind of more relaxed all the time, kind of more fatigued. We can see that in the heart sound recorder. Another thing too is the rhythm. Is it consistent every single time, or is it speeding up, or is it going back farther? But we can see the space between the first sound and the second sound to making sure that rhythm stays consistent. And lastly, the tone. Do we have a very strong heart? Um, I've actually had a patient that came in and we had they, we did the heart sound recorder once. We had them take that, that heart protomorphogen as I talked about. They took about one or two of them and you can see their heart graph go from little bumps, little first sounds to like very big. Because once you see, if you take that stress off the heart to allow it to repair itself, then you can see a very big increase in the strength and the tone of the heart. So that'll be another thing that we're gonna be looking at when our contestant comes up here to show you. So um, as of right now, I will introduce Dr. Chip and then we'll go over a little bit of the heart sound recorder and how this pertains to your health. Well, hello, hello. Would you like to introduce yourself, Chip? I am Dr. Chip and I will be the Contestant on the Price's Heart Sound Recorder. <laughs> All right. So first we got here is this is pretty much if you kind of see I got a little bit of a bumping here. So if I oh you can't see it, I'm going to show you real quick. <laughs> now you can see it. So we kind of see there's a little bit of a straight line here. If I'm going to pick up this microphone, I just picked it up and you just kind of saw there's a little bit of vibration going on here. So if I keep hitting this, then we can see that this going, oops, let me get this guy, go ahead. One second here. So if the chip takes it off of his body, so if you take it off his body, you can kind of see that if we place the microphone there, it's very soft. There's no vibration going to anywhere in this, this microphone. It's very soft. But if I very ever so slightly tap this, then you can kind of see that it, it, you can see it going off a lot. So, <laughs> so, if Dr. Yeah, so if Dr. Chip, if he places this on his heart, you can see, and we're going to be focusing on the mitral valve. There's four different valves, but we're going to focus on the mitral valve over there. Uh -huh. And you'll see that you can look at Dr. Chip's heart in real time. So Chip has a very good, strong tone. You can see it's very, very strong. A couple of ways that we look at this heart sound is that we need this first sound to be twice the height as that second sound. But we also want this length period to be twice the length as that length period. So you can see Dr. Chip has very strong tone. He's very consistent in his heartbeats, and his rate is very good. It's not, very, it's not condensed together. It's not super long. Um, we even have measurements that can find out the, the, the length between this one compared to the length between this one. So Chip has a very strong heart. He's on very good nutrition. He makes sure he tries to stay very uh, physically healthy, and he focuses on his uh, emotional health as well. So Dr. Chip, Thank you so much for your uh, example there. You are most welcome. Man. Oh, good. Well, thank yeah, you. I'm glad to be on the, <laughs> on the show. <laughs> All right. So we'll go back to this presentation. 
So I really want to just kind of give you a brief understanding of what the Heart Sound Recorder is. I know it's it's kind of short and sweet and to the point, but that's the beautiful thing about the Heart Sound Recorder. You don't have to, it's not painful. Um, there's no needles, there's no cuffs or anything. Um, Chip, you just put it on one part of this heart. When we come in here, we do actually four different valves. So we have it, uh, we can do the Heart Sound Recorder on each individual valve. And then we can uh, assess it from there. Um, we, we have an actual program in the office that's $99 for four different recordings. What we like to do is um, have the patient take the recording, um, go out in the waiting room and take a couple of supplements that were pertaining kind of to the vitamin Bs, vitamin Cs. There is a couple of other supplements that we can look at. And then you can instantly come back and you can see um, your results instantly by taking the supplements, as we kind of see before um, with that heart um, poromorphogen example. Um, so if you're interested, you always come back into the office. Uh, we're here at 2000 Jefferson, but um, you can always kind of keep up with us. We're going to have our next health shop on March 2nd about the digestion essentials, and we'll pertain that to the physical and the emotional and the nutritional parts of health. Uh, yet again, um, if you come to our health shops, uh, we deliver all kinds of free great things for you, a free health shop, free health check, an HRV screening, as well as health coaching session. This will be going directly as the nutritional, the physical, and emotional parts of health. Um, thank you so much uh, for being here. Um, it's kind of a short one for you, but we are on Instagram and Facebook. Please like us, share us. Um, Love us, and we're even on YouTube, Brighteon, that we'll put all of our videos on as well. So if you missed this one, it will be on Facebook, but all of our recordings will be on there as well. So uh, thank you so much for your time, and I'll see you next week.